Okay, we are just getting ready to start our investigation and I can tell you everything has been nothing but absolutely weird, bizarre. We are just setting up our nerve center right now. It's just the four of us. And then we got our equipment tech. Jeff was here, was helping our stuff. But ever since we got out of the house with the psychic medium, Vivian, this guy right here, Aaron, has had, had a lot of weird little issues. And I was just trying to focus on getting the cameras going with the guys, but Aaron came out one time and I thought he had a medical problem it kind of freaked me out a little bit because i haven't seen him like that asking me for assistance so i want to make sure that he was okay medically something is getting him the worst but i felt it as well it's strong in there they know that we're here so this is how we're starting right now with all of this going on we immediately go inside and because aaron is being affected we follow his lead hold on Aaron. come here hey what's he doing aaron what are you doing all right, listen to me, all right? Stay with us. I thought I walked through spiderweb. You feeling it? I'm feeling it. Whoa, that was weird. It's just us now. The energy in this house has completely shifted after coming in here with the psychic medium. Aaron has a strong feeling to go to the basement with the polter pod. Someone's telling me to go to the basement. I don't know why. That's all I hear in my head. Let's go. Give me that polter pod. Here. Nothing but scallop. That's good. We're coming down. Why did I feel like we need to come down here? Why are you affecting me like this? As Aaron asks, why is he being affected, an unexplained light anomaly shoots directly into him. Why are you affecting me like this? Whoa! What is this all about? Right? Be careful. Just as Aaron discovers this creepy room, a voice tells him to be careful. What is this all about? Right? Oh! Oh! Be careful. Wait, hang on. by you and me, dude. It was like a woman going, oh. You gotta give me a heart attack. Sorry, dude. You can't do that, bro. This is scary. You can't do that. Do what? Something goes, ooh, right in my oh, ear. Aaron, you're gonna give me a heart attack. What'd you hear? I didn't hear anything. I heard a woman go, ooh. Aaron claims he heard this woman's voice as he opened the mysterious door. We immediately head back there to see what's inside. Down here. As we enter this room, there's a very eerie vibe in here. So we sit down and I call out Joe Walker, the guy who Mr. Whitmore killed with his posse. Are you seeking revenge for your death from Whitmore and his posse? Oh, did you just hear someone talking? After we hear another voice come from inside of this room, I subconsciously begin repeating, go to the bedroom, go to the bedroom. Go to the bedroom. He's waiting for you. Go to the bedroom, he's waiting for you. Where's the bedroom? Go to the bedroom, he's waiting for you. That's what I'm here. Go to the bedroom. We all now make our way to the second floor bedroom, where we were told a former roommate saw two men staring at her while she slept, while also experiencing paralysis. She woke up and she saw two men watching her. Going back up to the second floor. This is the first time we've been back up since we were up here with Vivian the Psychic and had some EVPs in that front room there. Two male voices. Do something! 
Make a noise. Turn on a light. Do something to let us know we're not alone. Do you hear me? What is that? As I snap this thermal picture, I want you all to look very carefully at the two blue what appear to be male figures standing behind the couch. You can easily see distinct shoulders, torsos, legs that go behind the couch, and even a head on the left figure, who appears to be wearing a hat. This hot spot in the middle is our Night Vision X camera. Moments before I snap this photo, Billy shoots in that direction and you can see that the windows are evenly covered with drapes, which does not give any explanation as to why these two very cold, as represented by the blue color, male-looking figures are captured in this photo. And remember, this spot is right outside the bedroom where the former roommate saw the two male apparitions and where the psychic just told us where she saw two men. To make this even more shocking, this is also right near where we captured those two male EVPs. This is the room where I saw the two men sitting in this corner. If there are two men in here and you claim this room as yours, why are you in here and who are you? As I am completely unaware that I just captured this photo, we turn around and decide to head to the attic. We're going up to the third floor. I don't know why you go on those steps, man. This is weird. I don't know if I want to do that. I just got a pressure in my chest. And he got a migraine. This is exactly where Aaron was when he had migraine. Are you just pressing on my chest not to... Because you don't want me up here, right? Aaron, get up here. I, I don't know. Come up here now. I, I don't know, dude. I really... I know. Come here, please, because I can't move. I don't have a camera. Let's go. Up, here. up, up. Here. No, I can't. I don't, I, dude, I don't know if I can go through, through that again, here. bro. I don't know if I can go through yeah, all that come again. Come on. Let's go. Get up here. Get up here, please, Aaron. I'm being serious. I'm being serious, too. Okay. Come on. I need you. Let's go. We're going upstairs. Let's go. What is this? Are you down this hall? There's a hallway down here. There's rooms here. Can you come out and do something with us? Hold on there. Watch out, watch out. Oh, something just made a noise in here. Let's go. I'm going in. I'm going in. Is that where the growl came from? Holy <laughs> Did you hear that? No. Dude, did you hear that? No, I didn't. Is that where the growl came from? Holy <laughs> Holy <laughs> Did you hear that? Oh, did you hear that? No, I didn't. Bro, it was just straight up like there's a king cobra in there like that. Yeah. Are you serious? Just, whoa, whoa. What was you that? You hear the bull? Yes, bull, yes. Bull. That's up here. All of a sudden, we all feel the third floor vibrate. Are you serious? Whoa, whoa. We wonder if it could also be our bodies responding from passing through some type of portal. The energy up here is absolutely overwhelming. Stay here and film me. Okay. Who's down here that I can see? What is your name? What's your first name? What? What did I just say? What's your first name? What? What did I just say? It's a really weird room. During all of this, Billy is keeping an eye on Aaron, who continues to act very strange. Do you hear me? What's your name? Joe Walker? What? Winston? 